find the scalar product of two vectors v is equal to minus 3 i hat plus 4 j hat minus k a is equal to 6 i hat plus 2 j hat plus 4 k also find the angle between the two vectors so we want to find v dot a that is the scalar product which is minus 3 i hat plus 4 j minus k dot 6 i hat plus 2 j plus 4 k you have to know that this is a vx plus vy plus vz this is ax plus ay plus az we'll use this one to multiply this, use it to multiply that, use it to multiply this, we we'll do the same thing. Use this one to multiply and finally do this. So if we do that, we will get that uh, is equal to this time this is minus three times six i hat dot i hat plus minus 3 times 2 i hat dot j hat plus minus 3 times 4 i hat dot k hat plus 4 times 6 j times i plus 4 times 2 j dot j plus 4 times 4 j dot k minus 1 is in front of k minus 1 times 6 k dot i plus minus 1 times 2 k dot j plus minus 1 times 4 k dot k you remember that we have said that i dot i is equal to k dot k is equal to j dot j and is equal to one any other one i dot j is equal to i dot k is equal to k dot i is equal to k dot j is equal to j dot i and is equal to j dot k and is equal to zero so it means that this is one this is zero this is zero this is zero one zero 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 one so that uh, we see that v dot a is equal to this is a uh, minus 18 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus this is a uh, 8 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus minus 4 so we have minus 18 plus 8 minus 4 and it's equal to minus 14 so let us find the angle between the two vectors so the relationship between the magnitude of vector and the angle is v dot a is equal to the magnitude of vector v times the magnitude of vector a cos the angle between them therefore cos theta is equal to v dot a over the magnitude of v times magnitude of a so what we will now find is the magnitude of v equal to vx squared plus 
vy squared plus vz squared and it's equal to so it's minus 3 squared plus 4 squared minus 1 squared so if we put it we have square root of minus 3 squared plus 4 squared plus minus 1 squared and it will give us square root of 26 we do the same thing for a to find the magnitude of a it will be this a y squared plus a z squared all square root all square root so we have it to be c squared plus two squared plus four squared so it will be square root of c squared plus two squared plus four squared and that is 36 plus 4, 40 plus 16, 56, square root of 56. Therefore, we come back here and plug that. Therefore, theta is equal to arc cos v dot a. We have found it to be minus, uh, minus 14. So, we have minus 14 over square root of 26 times square root of 56 we have a arc cos 0 0.3668996929 that's what we have and if you use your calculator it's a minus here if you use the calculator it is one 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 point five degrees approximately that's how to do it kindly subscribe like the video and click on the notification icon so that when we post new video you see it bye